Welcome everyone to 29.10. First map change of the season. I'm your host, Protegees. And without further ado, let's get straight to it. So as you can already tell, the cube is starting to move. <clears throat> Once it touches water, it's going to begin to grow more. So, you're, basically everyone's screwed. <laughs> Because once, you know, once the cube touches the water, it's going to grow once it leaves it. And, well, as you can see, there's basically no remains of the house. The cube basically consumed all that was left of the house. Or what it spawned on. It, it consumed all the stuff that it was, like, on top of. Anyway, going on to the gnome's base. Coming down here. Oh. You can see they have finally finished their kitchen. Completely done. And also uh, set up more equipment in here. Uh, specifically over here. As you can see, they replaced a lot of their servers and move stuff around a bit <clears throat> like if you come up here they move their uh, whole like setup boards over here instead of having them in the corner right there it's easier access so they don't have to walk as far I guess kind of lazy but you know <laughs> yeah they're not doing much at the moment Come on over here into their like sleeping quarters. They're still playing darts. Not much really happened. But yeah, that's about it from for over here. Now moving on to the bears. We'll start over here with the uh, whole um, spiel they were doing to steal the car. Well, it does not go well at all. Because. <clears throat> Instead of putting it in reverse, they accidentally put it in drive, and they drove straight through the uh, garage wall. Which is why it's broken, and through the wall. And right now, they are escaping from the scene, so they don't get caught. Because they are wanted men. All the bears are wanted, as well as the gnomes, because they do a lot of illegal stuff. Anyway, moving on. Let's come on down over here to the very hidden gnome base so if you come in here the gnome is get this the um, assistant gnome is getting to work on the bear while you see the boss gnome is nowhere to be found come on up here you will see that the uh, quote-unquote purple gnome or not purple gnome purple bear is outside now why is he outside well, because someone knocked on the door, aka this guy, Boss Gnome is here, and he plans on killing the bear. Basically, what he did was, he knocked on the door, and he kept making like small noises while he uh, escaped, so the bear would follow them outside, so, which in which the bear did. He hid behind this tree, and he lured him out to this point, where he saw this, the uh, case laying on the ground behind the trailer. So the gnome got him to walk to it, which the whole plan is working. What he plans to do is kidnap him and then kill him. Like, he's going to bring him down to their hidden hideout down here. Yeah, things are getting spicy up in the storyline between the bears and the gnomes. Also, if you come all the way over here, in Wasted Woods, formerly known as Wailing Woods, you can see the bears are pouring the gasoline stuff on flammable stuff, such as the wood and couches. As you can see, the uh, veteran, veteran bears sitting outside keeping watch so no one interrupts them or catches them in the, in the process. Anyway, that's it for the Bear and Gnome storyline. 
we're all up to date on that. Anyway, moving on to Sandfest. My personal favorite location, Chonkers Sandfest, has been updated a little bit. As you can see, they added a water tower to the motel so they have their own source of water that they don't really have to keep replenishing. So, and then they store it up there. And over here, they also set up some um, boat boards. And this like beach area is now known as Salty Shores, which is what the sign says. That's why these two are up. As you can see. And as you can see here, the uh, Sandfest is booming. A lot of people enjoy it. More stuff has been added. More uh, crap has been thrown over here in the tires. And a tent has been set up. Not much else, really. A bunch of police cars have been set up. Because they want to be able to get to uh, accidents really quickly. In case any of them happen. Like these two. And taxi. And yeah. Basically, for Sandfest, not, not like too significant much changed. Uh, the two bears are now talking with each other over at their camp area. They're staying with the people over here. And the car has finished the uh, race and he's moving back to his RV. And yeah, these two are in the midst of a racing. About to go over the jump hopefully they don't they don't crash and while we're over here another cube has spawned destroying all the trees that were here it is kevin he has risen from the dead so yeah a lot of bad stuff's gonna happen we'll see what happens next and ooh. oh and finally, the windmills are working now. They got the time to replace all the windmills in the past couple days since the last map, since the uh, season premiere. And now they are working, so they should have a more reliable source of power. That's about it from over here. Not, nothing changed the vacant vicinity, so I don't have to go over anything there. Uh, don't mind uh, this is a fix that there we go over here not much else changed as well all they did was bring down one of the shipping containers from up there that's all they did really and not much else that's all they really did anyway moving on over here more danger is spawned there are now four cubes over here. One big one and three baby ones. Things are uh, not looking very good for Kremlin Island at the moment. Uh, Dust Pleasant Port has temporarily halted because of the danger that's over here. So as you can see, it's pretty empty looking. Like if you view it from a distance, it looks pretty empty. So all the workers like evacuated from the place and well they just don't want to die no one does really anyway moving on we're gonna go over shattered city anyway to start the uh water tank supply has been upgraded and is now well brand new pretty much uh, these guys have fixed up the building more, and they are pretty much almost done. Just about to wrap up what they're doing. And yeah, that... <laughs> to be honest, I think that is it. Not much. Really changed. Just going through everything. Uh, the construction on this is halted so they can help work on this construction up here. 
and yeah. Oh yeah, a lot of a lot more uh, partying has been going on down here, so a lot more garbage has appeared. And they got the disco ball going. That's it for over here. And I think that is it for the map change. Thank you guys for watching. And as always, be sure to like and subscribe. It's very much appreciated. And I shall see you guys in the next one. Adios.